Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for around the 27th. So we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for the 27th? You may need to defend yourself. I just saw like a shield. So when you see a shield, it means you have to defend yourself. So pay attention. Um, you may be, be feeling like you are under attack for some reason. Somebody may be attacking you, you know, verbally, whatever. Or you may be, you know, if you think about uh, being judged for a situation, you may feel like you're, you know, you need to defend yourself. And maybe you do need to defend yourself. Maybe you need to withdraw. Maybe it's best to just walk away. You may be expecting some sort of trouble um, because I just see the Nine of Wands, which is defensive as well. So you're probably going to be on defensive on this day or you may need to be. There there may be a reason for that. There could be somebody that's under a lot of social pressure. Perhaps there's been some poor counsel and somebody's having a hard time doing the right thing to do to society, but now they're being pressured. They're being pressured for some reason. It's like somebody's pointing the finger. They're pointing the finger at you and they're like, why did you say this? Why didn't you tell the truth? You know, what? why? How come you didn't tell the truth? You know, and so now it's like <gasps> caught off guard. I feel like we have somebody here that may be caught off guard because some some sort of truth comes out and you're like, oh, my God, you got caught in a lie. So somebody may be getting caught in a lie um, and now they got to an answer to that lie and they may need they may be feeling defeated. OK, and this is like um, intimidation. You may be being or interrogated by a person. It feels like there's a hostile situation here. Um, there's been some sort of abuse and somebody may have been hiding the abuse and now the abuse is coming out. Somebody may have uh, abused their power, you know, tried to dominate a situation and uh, now they're they're being, you know, questioned. Um, I, there's a lot of, there's some feeling of strong control, you know, wanting to be in control, wanting to have that power. And so they lied to, to keep that power. Um, I feel like somebody's going to have to answer to, uh, the system, whatever the system is, whatever. It's like, now you got to answer to what you did. So that's coming up very strongly here. Um, somebody has been trying to do too much. Um, they've, they've made a, a choice based out of illusion. Okay. Um, and they should have chosen a better choice, but they didn't, they, they, they couldn't because of social pressure. So that's what we're dealing with now. I do feel like we have somebody here that has ill health. They're very unhealthy and they're probably, um, because they made a bad choice and they refuse to listen. They refuse to listen to anybody. They refuse to listen to their elders. They refuse to listen to a counselor or they just refuse to listen because of their pride and their ego. And now they're going to be subject to some sort of trial or interrogation. I know I just said that, but then I just saw the judgment reversed again. So I do feel like there is some sort of uh, poor choice that is coming back to haunt somebody in the very near future. And they're going to have to answer to it. Um, just be prepared for that. Be prepared. Now I see the temperance reverse, which is another ill health card. We have somebody here that is very unhealthy. And they're very imbalanced and they need to heal. They need to heal. And I think it, that they really need to re-examine who they are. They may need to go to a hospital or go to a rehab or something like that. Um, they keep engaging in negative patterns, you know, in repetitive behavior when they should really own up to whatever their problems are and just deal with them. And so anyway, um... There could be some sort of termination that is coming up. Somebody could get terminated from their job or from some sort of contract that they are or their responsibilities. It's like you're removed from your responsibilities. You need some sort of help that could be coming up. There's irresponsible behavior here and there could there's somebody that has like a self image problem, you know, and they somebody could really be losing their job. Um, there's image problems as well, uh, food issues even, um, maybe there's somebody that is underweight or they're overweight and they're just really, there's just really an unhealthy situation here that needs to be dealt with. Somebody needs to get their life back on track. They may need some professional help to do so. Um, and there's defense. It's like they need to, it's feeling the need to defend themselves. I feel a strong need for defensiveness. Envy, envy. So we have some jealousy here. And you notice the 20 was 20 judgment. And I did see judgment. So we are going to be dealing with judgment in the very near future. Karma, perhaps. Jealousy. 
um, somebody's jealous behavior may have gotten them into trouble when all they had to do was work a little harder to uh, work a little harder in many different areas of life to obtain success instead of being jealous um, do what you got to do So this all stems from jealousy. It all stems from envy. Somebody's envy has gotten them in trouble. What do we have for the 27th or thereabouts? Keep in mind that the timing is fluid and this reading is not sign specific. Just take what resonates and leave the rest. could have to do with children. We could be dealing with some children here. Um, or people that act like children. Um, there is a new opportunity. It's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy to start over. It's not going to be easy to uh, do something you've never done before. We have somebody here that um, is going to be given an opportunity to go down a new path. But they may feel a little uneasy about it. Okay. Um, it looks like this is a golden opportunity. Okay, it's a big, huge opportunity, but it's going to take uh, remaining focused and keeping on track. And it's not easy to keep on track. So I, I feel like uh, it's um... well, these are both messages as well. These are messengers. Now, this is love. Page of Cups is a messenger of love, and this is this is stability. So there's an opportunity for love, and there's an opportunity for stability. But this is uncomfortable, okay? So I, I feel like we have, I mean, this could be a vindictive individual here. It, it really looks like we have a vindictive individual here, somebody that is selfish, This person is a, we have a jealous, selfish individual here who may be using children in a negative way, just being honest with you. Um, I think that we have a split coming, okay? Because this is a family unit, but it's breaking apart. It is breaking apart. There could be a divorce here. There could be a split. There could be a split of children with that involves children. There's a marriage, perhaps, that is breaking apart or a commitment that is breaking apart. It's messy. It's very messy. I feel like this person is, is super jealous, super vindictive, out for themselves. So we do have a jealous, vindictive individual here who is out for themselves and may have used children to get their way. Just saying, you know, in the court or something like that. <laughs> well, we have somebody that is about to experience some upheaval. Somebody's going to get thrown out. There's going to be some fireworks in the very near future. This is a shock. Somebody is going to get a shock. And it, I do believe it does involve some children. Okay. Um, light is about to be shed on a situation. Somebody has been naive. And maybe it's a child that has been naive. You know, children are naive, right? Children are naive. They just don't know. They don't know. I think there's going to be a new foundation that is laid out because we have a foundation that isn't stable. We have a foundation that isn't secure, that is crumbling, and it is going to crumble really, really fast. We have a foundation here. We have a foundation here. And this is a new foundation being laid out, being started. I think that somebody is going to see a false foundation crumble. It may have to do with, I mean... It looks like there's a relationship here that is crumbling. There could be two children involved. May or may not. There could be one child involved. <clears throat> we have one very, very vindictive, jealous individual that is probably going down. This person's going down by the looks of things. 
They may have lied or, or done something using the children, lied about the children, lied about a child, something like that. It doesn't have to be. But this is a very jealous individual that is going down, going down. Um, you know, the tower is an accident or a major disruption in somebody's life that something is about to destruct. Mm. Ooh, we have the Queen of Swords and we have the Ten of Swords. Now, the Queen of Swords is somebody, could be a lawyer, could be somebody in the law, could be, could be, uh, well, this person has information. This person is a truth speaker. This person speaks the truth. This person is very authentic. Um, this is about an ending. We do have an ending here. We have a major life change. Something is about to change, and I think it's going to be sharp. There's going to be something is going to happen, and it is going to cut like a knife. It is going to hurt. It is definitely going to hurt. I feel like there is some sort of truth that is going to be spoken that is going to cause an ending. Now, when you get the Ten of Swords, this could this could be this could be a catastrophe. Okay, uh, it could be. It could be um, somebody may have went as low as they could go and you know now it's coming back to haunt them I think there is some sort of truth that is going to come out that is going to break down a false foundation so fast that you don't even see it coming and I think it does have to do with children there is some, this person speaks the truth she knows the truth she's very intelligent and she waits for the right moment to to deliver the truth so there is some sort of truth that is coming out that is going to hurt. This is the hurtful truth. Okay? So be prepared for that. And I think that um, it may have to do with children or a child. Um, it might, whatever it has to do, um, it has to do uh, with the truth. It has to do with the facts. Okay? Somebody is going to be delivering some facts. And uh, these fell right about here, didn't they? They were down there. So we do have a rude awakening. We have this jealous individual here that is about to get a rude awakening. Whatever they have been doing, whatever they have been doing behind the scenes, whatever they have been doing to uh, hurt another person because of their jealous ways is about to uh, be seen by the looks of things we have a this person is wise very very wise and has some sort of information that is going to bring the tower down on this person I'm telling you what this is a messy ending and I think it's a little scary. There, if there's a child involved, this is a little scary. It is a scary. It is scary. This person looks a little scared. They're given this new opportunity to start over, you know, to do something else. And I think it's scary. Things are going to happen fast. And I do believe it has to do with children. We have the Six of Cups in reverse there. I think we have somebody that is being, being relieved of their obligations. And it could be as a parent. I'm just, I got to be honest with you, I'm not trying to scare anybody. And I don't want anybody to come on here and say, how could you say something like that? That is reality. We have a person up there that is malicious. That person is malicious. And they're going to be judged for a situation. That is, I would consider that my judgment card. That is a 20 that I would consider they are going to be judged for their actions. There is movement in it. It's movement. And maybe they're moving. And somebody could be moving with their children, okay? Somebody could be moving from their children. Or with their children, I meant to say. But with whatever comes out, comes out. We do have an ending here with the Ten of Swords. This is, it's over. It's over. Goodbye. Somebody, somebody tried to do too much. They tried to do too much. Prove it. This is like false pretenses. I think we have somebody here that lied. 
They lied about who they were. <clears throat> and now the truth is coming out. Be prepared for some fireworks. Something is going to happen fast. Somebody is being pushed in a new direction. And it is, they're being brought to a new direction. Or brought to a new place. This is moving very, very quickly in a new direction. The Six of Cups reversed is freedom from obligation. Packing up and leaving home. We have somebody here that's had selective memory and they only tell things that they want to tell and they and they and they they may have said, "Oh, I forgot," or you know, they may be a pathological liar. They believe their own lies. And there could be some child abuse here. The 6 of cups reversed with these there could be some child abuse here that comes to light. There's light that is going to be shed on a situation by this Queen of Swords. Now the Queen of Swords is a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, could be anybody else, but whoever this person is, this person is truthful and honest and forthright and intelligent, an investigator. This is an investigator. This is a protector. This is somebody that is professional. This is somebody that gathers the facts and delivers the facts. So there is some sort of facts that are going to be delivered that breaks down a false foundation. And there certainly could be a child involved. There is obviously somebody here that is very vindictive and jealous of another person who hasn't been telling the truth. It could be about a marriage. It could be about a contract. It could be about a foundation that they built. Whatever. This false foundation is coming to an end. False foundation, I'm telling you what, is coming to an end. And it is going to cut like a knife. One more card, please. There is going to be news that is arriving. That somebody is going down a new path. Okay, somebody is going someplace else whether they like it or not. This is universally driven. We probably do have a child involved here. This is the moment of the de of decision. The decision is being made. So a decision is being made. Somebody is dealing with another person that is it's like stunting their growth. There's no growth here. We have somebody here that, this is bad news, that makes excuses and doesn't tell the truth. We have somebody here that has been lying and I think they're going to get caught in their lies. And I do think it has to do with children. And if it doesn't have to do with children, it has to do with pa the past. Because the Six of Cups is the past. There could also be somebody from the past that communicates that they want to start over this person you know that could be the case because this is somebody from the past communicating fearfully very fearful okay this is fearful this person is fearful it's like they could be offering an apology this could be an apology maybe they're they who knows and maybe they're jealous maybe they want a reconciliation Somebody from the past could be communicating they want a reconciliation. They're jealous. They're jealous of something. Maybe they got themselves involved in a false sense of security. Because they needed to fill a void. But that party is over. It's done. And they, you know, they're coming with the truth. That could be the case as well. There is definitely going to be some messages. This is bad news, though. The page of somebody could have gotten themselves involved with somebody that's not well suited for them. And now they've gotten their rude awakening. This person is not one to mess with. She expects the truth and will only take the truth. So somebody may be coming with the truth, knowing that they have to give the truth. You come to me with the truth or don't come at all. Somebody could be sending a message of love and with an apology. Okay? Somebody could be getting an apology. I'm really sorry. It's over. That person's gone. I threw them out. That could be the case for some of you. 
take what resonates and leave the rest. I really feel as though we have a shocking situation that is about to unfold. On one hand, it's good news. On the other hand, it's bad news. Good news, bad news. So there's good news and there's bad news. There's definitely a split here, okay? There's definitely a split. And somebody is moving in a new direction. And they're wanting to put in effort to build up a new foundation. Because whatever it is that they were involved in was false. So be prepared for somebody to choose a new direction. It's like they just make the decision. So I think there's going to be news that is arriving. From somebody that you have dealt with in the past. Good luck. <laughs>